Hi, my name is Emmy Pope, and this is my story. July 17th of last year, I packed me and my three little girls up, and we got on a Greyhound bus, and we came to San Antonio due to the fact of an abusive relationship with my soon-to-be ex-husband. I wanted to go to college and learn more about the things that I was learning. I met my ex, and he's like, oh, well, you don't have to go to school. You don't have, it's easier if you just give up, don't worry about it. Two months after I dropped out of school, I ended up pregnant. Was not planned or anything, but I'm very blessed. I got pregnant with my first little girl. Her name is Summer Poe. Three years later, I had Autumn Poe. Two years later, I had Winter Poe. They call them my little seasons. <laughs> I wanted to go back to school while I was pregnant just to get my GED, but I didn't have any support behind me. I was always worried about working and taking care of the girls and trying to get by in life rather than just get my education. Now it's, I work, but I also make time for the girls. I go into work at four and I work until one o'clock in the morning. I get off from work, it's about a 30 minute drive home. So I get home about 1.30. Winding down from work, I go to bed about two and then it's back up at 5, 5.30, 6 o'clock in the morning. It's hard, I've had my nights where I just want to give up, but I don't want my girls to think once something gets hard or once an obstacle gets in your way, you just give up on school or whatever it may be. How far are you willing to push yourself to really accomplish what you want to do? I want my GED. I want to go to college. I want to see how far I can go. Palo Alto College has given me the support and just they're always willing to help, always willing to work with you. And I didn't actually know about the scholarship until I got here and was looking into the GED and they offered it. That one chance could be a change in their life. It could be a goal that they never thought they could accomplish that now they can do it. Thank you for all that you're doing to help people like me.